okay so should i start uh, we will continue till 4:10 after that i will complete the video and i will upload it to for you i will give you the link i will share that link okay so should i start at uh, uh, 459 i think that you have the math lecture right yes sir yes sir so at uh, 4 4 10 you can leave the meeting i will complete this video i will then uh, upload it for you okay till then uh, you stay with me let us see uh, how to draw further so we are talking about the b dash x this is the centripetal component centripetal component is parallel to the link ab link ab ko parallel and it will be acting towards the center okay so for point a b point is the center so this uh, b dash x which you will uh, draw it will be uh, along this line b dash x like this so b dash point is here okay you go in this particular direction like this okay so from here i will go in this particular direction by how much distance so b dash x means centripetal component kitna value nikala tha humne centripetal acceleration of a with respect to b this is the, this is the the value 20400 so divide it by 2000 तो कितना आएंगे 2000 से डिवाइड करेंगे तो 10.4 10.4 फोर टेन पॉइंट फोर एम एम ओके बी डैक्स एक्स का जो लेंथ निकलेगा वो 10.4 पॉइंट फोर एम एम निकलेगा टेन पॉइंट सो यू विल ड्रॉ दिस लाइन इक्वल टू 10.4 पॉइंट फोर एम एम एंड यू विल लोकेट द पॉइंट एक्स एक्स पॉइंट विल बी हियर uh this direction b dash x b dash x is parallel to link ab link ab ko parallel so i will do b dash x is parallel to link ab link ab okay and length is 10.4 mm then after uh, locating the centripetal component you go for tangential component you know that tangential component is perpendicular to the centripetal component okay so this tangential component will start from point x so point x yahan pe hai और ये जो टेंजेंशियल कंपोनेंट है वो सेंट्रिपिटल कंपोनेंट को परपेंडिकुलर है तो आपको क्या करना है ये जो लाइन अभी आपने ड्रॉ किया है उसको आपको परपेंडिकुलर लाइन ड्रॉ करना है लाइक दिस ओके आई डोंट नो द लेंथ लेंथ ऑफ दिस लाइन एंड आई ऑल्सो डोंट नो वेदर आई शुड ड्रॉ इट अपवर्ड और डाउनवर्ड i can draw it anywhere what i know that on this line this point a dash will come okay because i don't know the magnitude of a tangential component also so i will tell you that this line i have drawn this line i have drawn in order to find the point a dash correct 
and this particular line x a dash is perpendicular to the centripetal component is called perpendicular hai ya jo link ab hai usko perpendicular hai is tarah okay why we don't know the magnitude of tangential component because in tangential component formula uh, you know what is the formula for tangential component radius okay so radius which radius ab ab into angular acceleration angular acceleration of which link that is link ab so angular acceleration of link ab is not given to us that's why we cannot calculate the tangential component we cannot calculate the tangential component but we know that direction of tangential component is perpendicular to centripetal component so humne wo direction bana liya aur वो लाइन देखो है वहां पे हमें पॉइंट ए डैश मिलेगा ठीक है तो इफ यू पीपल वांट टू लीव यू कैन लीव आई विल कंप्लीट दिस वीडियो एंड आई विल अपलोड इट फॉर यू ओके नेक्स्ट स्टेप इफ यू कैन स्टे वी कैन फिनिश इट आई थिंक इन फाइव मिनट्स ओके but uh, uh, you you can go so that you will have a, a relief for 5 minutes will get refreshed for the math lecture okay now after this uh, uh, let us see uh, the acceleration of point a with respect to point o okay because here point o is the fixed point okay how we can write the equation uh, for that i will again delete some data okay so let me delete this so as i will write it like this acceleration of point a with respect to point o okay now here uh, as point a and point o is not connected they are not on the same link so i will not write components for it like this okay what i will do i will write the vector name for it so acceleration of a with respect to point o it will have a vector o dash a dash okay means this particular uh, vector will start from point o dash and will end at a dash so we already know that the velocity of point a absolute velocity of point a is horizontal okay so similarly the acceleration of point a will also be in the horizontal direction what is whatever is the uh, path of the point a okay in the same path this vector will be there so this line o dash a dash it will be parallel it will be parallel to path o a okay so i will draw a line from point o dash parallel to the line o a here like this and wherever this line gets cut to so this uh, line which we have already drawn for a dash there i will get the point a dash o dash a dash 
okay in this way you will complete the acceleration polygon okay uh, where you have seen that b dash x is the centripetal component and x a dash is the tangential component x a dash is the tangential component of acceleration of point a with respect to point b like this okay as these two are components b dash x and uh, x a dash we can uh, join them we can add them vectorially in order to find out the total acceleration okay so total acceleration will be this one it is your total acceleration what is this acceleration it is the acceleration of point a as the arrow is towards point a with respect to point b okay what about other so this is what it is nothing but acceleration of point a as i am not writing with respect to point o means it is the absolute acceleration it is the absolute acceleration of point a because point o is fixed so even if you don't write it point o here it's okay similarly here you can write it is the acceleration of point b it's okay because this acceleration of point b is is with respect to point o okay so uh, in this way uh, you will complete uh, all of you please join the mass lecture guys ma'am has given you the time okay sir yes yes please leave the leave this otherwise it will it will my says all of you join the mass lecture will you i will complete this video myself and i will upload it for you all of you leave Nehali Suraj, you also leave. I will complete it myself. So it will come. It will like this. It will complete the uh, acceleration polygon also. Okay. Now uh, let us concentrate on what to find. What we have to. find okay so let me again uh, erase something and make space so as you can see that uh, velocity calculations we have already done only the acceleration part is remaining so you have to find the acceleration of point a okay and angular acceleration of link ab so acceleration of point a can be find acceleration of point a can be find what is asked it is the absolute acceleration so for that vector is o dash a dash o dash a dash so you measure uh, this vector in mm from the diagram 
and then you multiply it by 2000 because 2000 is the scale factor which you have selected okay so by that you will multiply it and you will get the answer for the acceleration okay so you complete this you uh, so 1 lakh 8000 it is coming as 1 lakh 8000 up the road yes, sir. so why are you not joining the mass lecture so i have joined it in other device it has not started yet okay 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 then so it is uh, coming like that okay one lakh eight thousand something you know this procedure that how i have drawn it okay i will also upload this uh, video for you then next what we have to find is the angular acceleration of link ab alpha ab so which formula is there for alpha ab you, you can see that it is appearing here alpha ab so i can write the equation i can write the equation alpha ab is equal to this tangential component tangential component of ab okay upon length of link ab length of link ab now tangential component of ab is what here it is given tangential component of a with respect to b is which vector x a dash the vector for it is x a dash okay so uh, i will take the vector length x a dash from this acceleration polygon so x is here and a dash is here so i will measure this how much mm it comes and 51 and uh, yes and i will multiply it by ka the factor 2000 which you have considered x k a upon what is the original length of link ab so link ab ka original length kitna tha hai? that is given as 600 to us this is given as 600 so you put all these values and you will get some value for the angular acceleration of link ab how much you get 170 170 so 170 and unit of angular acceleration is radian per second radian per second square radian per second square radian per s so in this way you will complete your acceleration analysis part also okay if you do practice of more problem then you will realize the um, method of construction of velocity polygon acceleration polygon only you have to draw the parallel lines and perpendicular lines of required length okay that's it so i will end the lecture today here only and i will upload this video for you okay so thank you sir take care